Okay, so 9-1, creating and using multiple files in PowerShell ISE. So you start Windows, you search for PowerShell or Windows PowerShell ISE or just PAL like I did. Do the Windows, type in PAL, and there's the ISE, not Windows PowerShell because that doesn't give you all these options here. Okay, if you wanted to create a file, you just do file and then new, but also just like uh, any other document software, notice how it has this toolbar up here. You could just uh, hover over there to see, or hover over these buttons just to see what they do. Just another way to save, you can do file save, or you could just click the save, or you can do control S to save. Okay, so we did file new. Now I'm just gonna type in hello. Then we do file save as, just like any other program, but uh, you wanna make sure that you have the right extension. So if I were to create a web page, just like I showed you in uh, Notepad++, uh, you know, there's different options here, but it's not, it doesn't have the option that I want, htm. So I would have to do all files and then type in whatever I want to call it, .htm. And I hit save, and now it has up on the top, hello.htm. So that's how I know what uh, type of file it is. And that's pretty much it. You know, just like a regular document, um, you just save, open, you can open, you can save, you can close, just like any other document software.